welcome back to the limited country I'm Holly and today we have another amazing home tour to share today and this home tour is not only fall but Halloween as well so you guys are gonna get just a sprinkle of Halloween here and there and I'm so so excited it is in my friend Charlie's home from farmhouse Charlie you guys have seen her here for spring you guys have seen her here for summer and I will link both of those videos in the description box down below because it's really just amazing, full of farmhouse decor, and you guys are gonna love it. So one thing I really love about Charlie is she is very much, we're very similar in the fact that we both love farmhouse decor, but she goes all out and I do not go all out. And if you guys have been familiar with my channel, you guys know that I'm very minimalistic with farmhouse decor now, and so I'm very intentional with the pieces I bring in. And so when I watch Charlie's home tours, there's like sprinkles of, I use, keep using the word sprinkles, I don't know why, but there's pieces that really stand out to me that I love. And I think that regardless of the type of home you have, regardless if you decorate with a lot of decor or a little bit of decor, which I'm a little bit, you can get inspired by all sorts of people. And so that is one of my favorite things about these home tours, is even though it might not be my particular style, if somebody decorates with a ton of antiques because I only have a very few antiques in my home I might be like I love that vintage scale I want that and um, it might be on my to-do list of when I go thrifting or if I go to an antique mall or something like that so I'm so excited to have Charlie here today there's so many pieces I'm like oh, they're gorgeous so I'm so excited you guys are gonna love her tour and it wouldn't be a home tour without a deal of the day and so I am so excited because I just purchased probably it's been a month and a half now and it just arrived like three or four weeks ago and it's my pure up and if you guys know my channel you know I love candles I love my diffuser and I love making my home smell absolutely delicious this is not sponsored I purchased this pure smart device it is a smart diffuser it's so fun and it's got these amazing candle scents and so it's one of those things that you can leave running while you're not home and it can be controlled with your device, which is super, super cool. And they were kind enough to let me have a 15% off coupon code to give to you guys, which I personally used as well. And I already have my next order set to go for October 6th. And in my order, I actually have another Pura device for our bedroom. And then I have two new fragrances because my fragrances haven't gone to low at all. They're still on high. And what's really cool about the Pure device is it actually tells you when, um, here's my Pure. So it shows in the kitchen and the scents that I have, but it actually shows you when the device is needing to be refilled. It shows remaining oil is high, which I've been running this nonstop. And then you can also pick the intensity. So you can have it at two or three, all the way up to 10 and you can pick which fragrance that you want. So right now I've got this really, really yummy citrus scent going, and I have to say though, my favorite scent, which is right here, and I switch them up all the time. Um, this is the Capri Blue Volcano. This is their highest rated one. I highly recommend it, and they have a, a few fall scents. I've been waiting for those to get back in stock, so by the time you guys are seeing this, it might be back in stock, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. 15% off in the coupon code section down below. So the description box. So I just wanted to share with you guys that awesome little find. It's a night light. You can change the lights and it is just so cool. So let's go ahead and tour my friend Charlie's home today. Let's get inspired for fall and Halloween and let's go ahead and get started. Hi guys, Charlie here from Farmhouse Charlie on Living at Country. We're super excited to be a part of this fall tour series and to just be able to give you guys some inspiration. Sit on back, grab a hot cup of something, put your feet up, grab a cozy blanket, and let's get ready for all the fall feels. All right, have a great day guys. We'll see you inside. Entering into our home, you'll find lots of different pieces of decor that we have fun with styling and decorating. For the entryway, I've decided to go with a little bit more of the spooky Halloween theme. Had fun decorating this. 
park your broom and sit for a spell. I have to admit, I have watched Hocus Pocus about three times already. Um, it's okay though. Getting all the fall feels in this space. really loving our fall decor this year it's been so much fun to decorate and so much fun to take part in this tour this fall tour we have my curio cabinet that I just got it was a Facebook marketplace find for 50 bucks and love this baby I'm trying to decide if I want to <clears throat> um, paint it white and distress it or not um, and or if I should just keep it this you know natural wood okay you guys I have to tell you about a lady <clears throat> this is by Marilyn Market this sign um, this pumpkin painted sign and it is beautiful. Oh my gosh, you guys, check this out. Is that not just perfection? Oh, pumpkin perfection. So thank you so much for sending that on over, friend. It's a perfect addition to our farmhouse fall vibes. Okay, so. As we Go on in. This is kind of what you see. And had fun with this one. This picture is actually of my my mother when she was pregnant with me on the top right. And her mother and her some of her sisters. She's one of ten, so a couple of them were there. Anyways. So we go in, this farmhouse um, sign I got um, a while back from two girls, Jen and Kathy, Junk and Jehoshaphat at My Eclectic Home, um, which is where I'm a vendor in, and love that sign, they, they hand um, stencil them. so. They don't use any vinyl or anything like that, but there's, I love, I mean, I have a Cricut maker. I love using vinyl. So, you know, it's to each their own and theirs, it works for them. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. Anyways. All right. And here we go on into the kitchen in just a moment, but I'll take a quick shot of this. I've got some really high ceilings going on and the pillow on the floor from the dog. <laughs> okay guys, here we go on into the, to the kitchen. Okay, so as we enter in to the kitchen, we have a few little tall touches give thanks my number seven sign we have my herb boxes that I love to decorate throughout the seasons and we have cozy autumn feeling room. Let's start out back here. Hope you guys are having a great day. Fall is my favorite. It's my absolute favorite. Somebody put it to me really well the other day that 
because I love Christmas too, <laughs> um, that fall is my favorite season, but Christmas is my favorite holiday. And <clears throat> for some reason I could never put those <laughs> that sentence together, but she put it so well. And I know it may sound simple, but anyways, just some autumn touches. I did this little today's specials. A little hot cocoa bar over here. Got my brick wall. Main Street coffee shop. And then right here we've got this amazing smell. I wish you guys could smell all of the fabulous smells from the home. Oh my goodness, they all, all the candles, all the diffusers and sprays and um, the kitchen stovetop potpourri, homemade potpourri. I made that this morning and it's delicious. We've got a little visitor here, don't we, honey? Say hi. <laughs> That's Hunter. If you guys have seen my previous home tours, then you'll have seen him <laughs> in, the, in the other videos. My collection of um, rolling pins and crocs. I made this pumpkin farm five miles um, sign the other day. A curio cabinet that I refinished. We love to refinish over here. And then my favorite piece of the house, well, one of them. I have several, but I love this hutch. It's like a pie tin, or pie safe, excuse me, pie safe slash hutch with the punched tin that I absolutely love. And then we've got this amazing little smelling and tasting um, spread that I did here. I thought it would be fun to kind of just make it look cozy and yummy and all the good things. So let's go on over here. You can hear the dog drinking his water just a view of the family room here we have the um, kitchen table where we don't do a lot of eating at this table. <laughs> um, a lot of people would probably ask, oh, so how do you eat at that table? If you see the dog doing this, scratching at the door, he does not have to go out. He wants his T-R-E-A-T, -E his treat. Um, and I'm really surprised he didn't turn around when I said that. So anyways, because he knows that word very well. Don't you, bud? Yeah. He knows that word way too well. <laughs> okay, here's a view of, of the family room in the kitchen. I absolutely love this room. It's my favorite room to be in. I'll just kind of give you a view.
I love my little repurposed candelabras. Hunter, honey. <laughs> he knows what time it is. Mama decided to start filming during his treat time, so. <laughs> Anyways, right here we have um, just another little vignette. Um, this is one of my favorite signs by Kendrick Holm. Um, fall Festival. Falling leaves and pumpkins galore. Yes, sir <laughs> And just some pompous grass. And loving all the fall feels. I hope you guys um, are having a fabulous beginning of fall. Over here you can see we like to go a little all out. Um, but hey, I'm an unapologetic maximalist and I wish I could be a minimalist, but that's just not in me. So here is it's a little bit of a glare, but you guys get the picture. Forgot to mention that I've got a couple of my favorite, absolute favorite candle companies, and I mean this when I say this. These are two of my favorites. Um, candle companies. I've got candles burning all over, but some of my favorites are MSJ Candle Co. and their maple pancakes are just heavenly. Um, I, yeah, they smell um, absolutely amazing. And they've got the great wick, the um, crackling wick, which I really like. <clears throat> okay, as we go on into the family room, we'll take a peek in here. Okay, as you enter into the family room, we have one of my favorite pieces to decorate, which is the antique snow bowl I have right here. Um, and my favorite little pup ever, huh, Hunter? Yeah? <laughs> I got this table from one of my favorite thrift stores for like nine dollars which was awesome i love to thrift and facebook marketplace and all the thrifty things over here this homestead country living family friends and livestock gather here is by tailored canvases and they make um antique looking canvas signs um that are very lightweight and very beautifully done. I think it's a great piece right there. And the church pew. Love my church pew. So when does it turn to fall for you guys? For me, in Washington, for us in Washington, it generally, just about now, maybe a few days ago, um, <clears throat> falls into fall. Summer collapsed into autumn. And just, I saw a sign that says, and just like that, summer collapsed into autumn. And I love that. And speaking of beautiful signs, my favorite sign, one of my favorite signs I've owned, is this sign that says <clears throat> let's get a good view autumn is God's way of showing us how beautiful change can be and boy is that true this sign is made by a woman 
<laughs> named Jen and her husband, who I believe his name is Jason. Um, they have a company called Isaiah 4110 Designs. And that's spelt I-S-I-A-H. And then the numbers, four and one. And then T-E-N Designs. So that's Isaiah 4110 Designs. And oh my gosh, you can tell how much love is put into their work because it is so high quality and it's so reasonably priced. So thank you, Jen, for this beautiful piece that you sent over. We love it and I'll have it forever. <laughs> Wherever we go, home-wise, which we're planning on staying here for a while, this will come with us for every autumn. little pumpkin sign I did. This cute little pumpkin. These are interchangeable. You can pop the pumpkin out and they sent me over a snowflake with it um, from how Signs & Co. made. I'll show you one of their beautiful pieces they sent as well, but I thought that was so fun. Um, yeah, just, just liking, like making my house a home and enjoy all the festive decorating. What's your favorite season? Is it summer, fall, winter, or spring? I'd love to know. Leave leave a comment in the comment down section down below. Okay, let's do one more shot of this room, guys, and then head on into the dining room and the living room. Here we go on into the living room. Dining room, excuse me. Okay, entering in the dining room. We have some more festive pieces. A little oil can designs, I'm not designs, excuse me, collection. Um, we've got these beautiful painted um, plaques by my friend Kathy, um, Catherine. Um, her company is Art by Kath and she is so talented. You can find her on Instagram at K L R Kids Co. And we just have my little shelves that I love to decorate. I just just got them. And as you can see, the dog is ruining the pillows. <laughs> Okay, so I just did the pillows very nicely and <clears throat> twice now and he has once again demolished them, but you know what? He's worth it <laughs> and it's all good. So you guys are going to get some real life over here and see the couch all messed up from the dog because I'm not doing it again. <laughs> Anyways, we've got this cool 
<clears throat> antique piece right here. Dandelion Wishes Candle Company, which is another one of my favorites. I have like a top five company for my favorite candles, and they're definitely in, in that top five. <laughs> my antique bingo cards, game cards. Just some more fall festive pieces. I went with a little bit more of a boho vibe, boho farmhouse vibe in here. <coughs> Excuse me, and I'm really liking how it turned out. just in his glory we love him dearly do you have pets comment down below let us know if you if you're a dog or a cat lover or an animal lover okay farmhouse signs and co this is our happy place sign is beautiful it's um such a pretty sign Honestly, I love the font and I just love the wreath and I feel like it can be used <clears throat> throughout every season. So that's another really sweet piece I love. Let's get cozy. Oh, my favorite season, you guys. And then the antique reproduction radio, this one. I have another antique radio. And here's the couch and the dog. <laughs> you can see I tried to arrange it nicely, but it's just not, not happening. Hunter does love to lick. We think it's a soothing thing for him. Got my chicken crate coffee table, some theater seats. I've let me know if you think I should reupholster these or if I should kind of keep them like vintage and tattered. <laughs> Same thing goes with these. Should I reupholster? Not reupholster. <laughs> should I refinish? Should I keep them kind of old and cool? There are so many things in our lives to be grateful for and thankful for. Okay. I really have enjoyed taking part of this fall tour, the tour series. You can find me at Farmhouse Charlie on Instagram and soon to be YouTube. So go check out Farmhouse Charlie on YouTube as well. And we'd love to have you as part of the Instagram and now soon YouTube family. Um, we just we feel blessed to be a part of this and to be of the community of living at country and thank you so much holly for letting us be a part of this awesome 
fam. <laughs> we hope you guys have a fabulous rest of your day. If you haven't already, check out all the other awesome ladies videos and um, just love you guys for watching and thanks so much. Okay. Have a great day, you guys, and happy fall, y'all. <laughs> all right. Bye-bye.